Hello, welcome back. Uh, in this video, we'll see how to create VLANs and how to assign the ports to the VLANs. As you can see, we have, uh, let's see, this is a building and we have the, the fourth floor, let's say, we have the sales department and let's say that's VLAN 10 and the ground floor, we have the finance department and let's say that's VLAN 20 and again in, on the ground floor we have accounting and that's VLAN 30 and another sales area here on the ground floor that's VLAN 10 part of this group and uh, let's say uh, second floor here uh, we have finance department again a part of VLAN 20 and third floor we have VLAN 10 part of sales so sales we have on the fourth floor first floor and third floor finance we have on the first floor and second floor accounting on the first floor so I have already assigned the IP addresses on to these PCs so this would be the one network the sales department 1.1, 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, 1.5, 1.6. .1 the finance gets uh, the second network 2.1 and 2.2 and 2.3, 2.4. Accounting uh, three network 3.1, 3.2. So the, that's how the, I have assigned the IP addresses. So now we have to go to the switch and create VLANs and not only we create VLANs 10, 20 and 30, we need to assign these ports to the, uh, the VLANs that we have just designed. The phase range F0, 1, 2, 4, right? And then F0, 9, this one this computer here 09 and also this one f0 12 f0 12 switch port mode access switch port access vlan 10 done we are done with vlan 10 not done <laughs> Uh, interface now we'll, we'll do the finance okay so that would be 5 and 6 10 and 11 interface range f0 5 to 6 comma f0 10 to 11 switch port mode access switch port access vlan 20 done with vlan 20 interface VLAN 30 next, okay. VLAN 30 would be 7 and 8. The phase range F07 7 to 8. Switch port mode access. Switch port access VLAN 30. Done. We are all done with uh, all VLANs. Uh, so now let's check the VLANs. Exit. Do show VLAN brief. You can see. We have three VLANs created with 10, 20, and 30. 10, we have assigned interface uh, 1 to 4 and 9 and 12. 20, we have moved F5, 6, and then 10 and 11 to 30. Sorry, 20 and 30, we have F0, 7, and 8. Now, my question is, even though the sales department has this PC here is in a different floor, let's say, will they communicate? Will they communicate? And what do you guys think? And same with the, this PC, right? Because that's uh, on a different floor, floor as well. Forget about this finance uh, uh, and accounting. They will not communicate with with uh, between sales or uh, accounting because they are in different network 
but this finance department here and also this finance department here will communicate because they have the logical connectivity meaning they are in the same VLANs we have moved these ports these ports to the same VLAN which is VLAN 20 so they should communicate same for the sales because we have moved the ports to the same VLAN so they have the logical connectivity so apart from different networks uh, these VLANs uh, since they are in the uh, uh, these ports uh, since they are in the same VLAN uh, they should ping we'll see we'll check but we will not be able to ping from 1.4 to 2.1 or 3 3 network because they are in a different network no physical connectivity or logical connectivity you can say okay so one let's try 1 to 4 or 1.1 and let's ping 1.5 ping 192.168.1.5 we are getting the reply because they are in the same VLAN so they have the logical connectivity now if I ping uh, six one dot six let's see one dot six we are getting the reply because they are in the same vlan so they have the logical connectivity now if i try to ping two dot one it will not ping because they don't have the uh, logical connectivity or physical connectivity they are in different networks so as you can see it's not going to ping here but now let's try 2.1 and ping 2.3 it will ping because they have the logical connectivity we are getting the reply because they have the logical connectivity and uh, if, we, if I ping 1.5 and ping 1.6 same VLAN so logical connectivity is there they are going to ping but if I ping from 3.1 to 2.1 it will not because they are in different network it's not going to ping there is a way to make them communicate we'll see that in a future video uh, even though uh, they are in different network uh, we can make them communicate we will need to add some things but we'll look at it in a future video so i hope this video helps somewhat thank you for watching and uh, in the next video we'll see